Now I'm telling you this guys, I never ever have a dream about the rapture, never. I never have a dream of revelation or God revealed, never. This is the first time I'm saying this. Hi guys, uh, my name is Guy. I'm just here to share about a dream I had four, day, four days ago about the rapture. Now this is where the dream started. We were, I was in my kitchen and there were so many, there were loads of people in my kitchen. It looked like the, we were having a meeting in the kitchen and there were some people I knew into that home. The people I have very vivid on my head. In the front of me, there was a pastor and I was on the other side of the kitchen looked at, looking straight on him. As we were having that meeting, okay, things are on, things are not very clear. I'm, I'm just trying to say exactly what I am seeing, what I was seeing. Okay, we are having a meeting and then suddenly I felt like I want to sing a song or there was a song that was singing inside of me and then I knew the song but I cannot remember the song right now and I felt like the Holy Spirit tell me to sing that song in that meeting in that moment then suddenly I thought to myself I said oh my gosh no this is me I was not that couldn't be the Holy Spirit that could be just me and I didn't do it and then suddenly there was a little boy beside me he started humming that song inside of him he started singing that song and then I turned and I said oh my gosh that's the song the Holy Spirit was telling me just to sing in that moment in the meeting and then after analyzing so many I was just analyzing things as I, I, I said to myself no that could be just coincidence and I just left it I didn't bother at all and then suddenly there was a lady who looked like my wife she was standing on the door and then she suddenly started singing the same song as she started singing the song I said oh no that definitely God wanted me to sing that song in that moment as I tried to start to sing the song, the song just wasn't coming right on my mouth. As I'm trying to sing, it just wasn't, it wasn't right. Something wasn't right as I'm trying to sing it. And then suddenly, the pastor who was in front of me, straight away stood up and started giving out. Oh no, we have to stop this, this is not, this is not, all that kind of thing. It's just saying things like wasn't right. And then suddenly, the man who was beside me, who was a good friend of mine, saw that happen and with the other people who were around there, they say, okay, come on, who told you to say things? You can't say things like that to, you can't say things like that to people. You, you can't just stop someone who's singing all, but it's just that like small little argument in the place. And then in just in that moment which is change I was in my sitting room going to a friend who I knew it was a lady and I came close to her years and I say something to her years and then suddenly the word I said to that lady she started to cry me she didn't look at my face i cannot say i cannot say because it's someone it's quite personal i cannot share it i can only share to that person and then that person wiped her tears off and then she turned and moved away from me now this is things start happening 
as she passed me and she start walking back to the kitchen where the meeting was as I turn to look at her as she's walking then suddenly there was a bright light in the front of that lady and then BAM she was just gone then as I saw her I knew straight away I knew it was the rapture and then I looked to myself as I looked to my hands all between my hands there were crackings like lines in triangle shape it's really very strange shape all I knew my hands were opening there were lines like veins all around my hands and in the center of those lines was a pure gold not really pure gold shining so bright in the center of my hands they were so bright and I, I knew something was happening I was absolutely changing as I'm looking at it and then suddenly those lines they start as a real bright gold and then it was a bright light BAM suddenly I, I was completely taken up lift up straight away and I can see myself lift going up like being raptured like being taken suddenly and I can see myself no so my body was changed instantly completely changed now I'm telling you this guys I never ever have a dream about the rapture never I never have a dream of revelation or God revealed never this is the first time I'm seeing this now I'm saying this because God wants you guys to know now suddenly I was taken up up to the air and I can see myself being lift up in the air now gone may God give me the opportunity to see everyone in the kitchen who were left behind now I was not in the ground I was actually in the air looking at everyone from the corner of my kitchen in that moment what was happening now and suddenly everyone in that home knew the rapture happened straight to everyone in your way suddenly people start crying now they were sobbing crying so hard crying sobbing because they knew they were left behind and then in that instant that grief that crying completely stop and change into anger now people I never felt the anger I saw in my kitchen they were so angry you can see that venom come from those people and then suddenly they starting beating attacking kicking standing stepping on the pastor who were in the kitchen now people were so angry they were now they beating the beating the man go all the the attack he go in the kitchen you can see them standing on his head kick on his head punching on his head punching on no they were completely killing him in the kitchen and they were all screaming you didn't teach us right you didn't prepare us you didn't told us this gonna happen 
No, they comp was horrendous. And then suddenly I was taken, I was lifted up so high I can see the whole earth. One side of the earth, I won't tell what part of it, all I knew, one side of the earth was completely in darkness. Like something has happening. Oh, it was just in black hell, completely blacked hell. Like it was like a, an explosion or nuclear or all I knew was something bad did happen because all that side of the earth was completely you can know something happened in that moment. If something did happen that in that instant. Then I start seeing lightning flashing all around the earth. Just flashing lights. They start flashing. Flashing. And I can hear a voice saying 100, 200, 1,000, 2,000, 1 million, 2 million, 1 billion. I said, what is that? They were all people who have been taken out. You can see, I can see all the lights happen in that moment. And then suddenly I wake up. As I wake up, I felt like I came back on my body and my body was heavy, was, it felt heavy, it felt very sinful, dirty, compared to the body I had just a few minutes, few minutes ago when I was dreaming about the rapture. Now, people of God, something has been happening. Something is happening. The rapture is going to happen in any time. Look what is around you. Look what we're seeing today. Look what is happening on the world today. We have more natural disaster right now like we never had before. They like the bird pains. Something is happening. There is more people today who are having dream of rapture like like never before. God is God is warning his people. He's warning his people to tell everyone his son is coming back soon. Jesus is coming back soon. We need to be prepared. I don't know. I mean, this is why it came to my mind when I saw the pastor. Pastors. Teachers. Leaders. And the one who seen this video. If God has given you the opportunity to lead thousand, hundred, one, two people of God. God has given you to take care of those people. Tell them. Tell them. Because when that rapture happen, the chaos that will come the anger that will come to the, the to the same people of your church to the same people you are leading they going to change
If you don't tell them, they are going to change. The anger I saw among those people. They told that they were singing. You did not prepare us. You did not tell us. You did not tell us that the, the, the Son of God will come soon. You have been distracting us in so many, so many things today that Joseph we are doing. God's servants, I'm telling you, those people are going to change. The way they be that past, the way they completely standing, smacking him, boxing him, kicking him. Because that man did not prepare them. That man did not tell them the time we are living. Guys, I don't know if you're pro, pre-trib, post-trib, or crap, or that kind of rubbish. The enemy has been distracting the church. Completely distracting the church. By all that rubbish. Those are the pre pre trip Those are the post trip Those are this. Those are that. That is not important. What is important is coming soon. Prepare your people. And you who are listening to people who are listening. Including myself. We are. We are. We need to be preparing ourselves. We need to be expecting of his coming. We need to be those wise bride, the five wise bride. We need to be prepared, not be those foolish. It can happen in any time, people. Any time. This is my dream. Be prepared. Be alert. We don't know the time, the hour. May all we know. He told us to watch the signs. Jesus told us to watch those signs. And those signs are so on our faces today more than ever the technology has been so advanced that everyone who said i didn't see it is a liar everyone is aware there's so many people pulling their head in the sun not to see what is happening it's up to you guys it's up to me and it's up to everyone, even my family, who are watching this. Be prepared. Be excited. It's a turn is soon. Very soon. Very soon. Stop those distractions. Men of faith. It's time to change. There's no more time to build in buildings. It's time to build in the people of God. It's time to guide the people of God the right way. It's time to tell them. God bless you.